Now in the next one it says Vijay is trying to find the average height of the tower near his house. He is using the properties of similar triangles. The height of Vijay's house if 20 meter when Vijay's house cast a shadow of 10 meter. 10 meter ki shadow cast ho rahe kiske ghar ki Vijay ki. At the same time the tower cast a shadow 50 meter long on the ground and house of Ajay cast 20 meter shadow on the ground. Take a tower ki on the hand. They are saying cast a shadow 50 meter long. It is casting 50 meter long on the ground. Of Ajay's house cast 20 meter sub ki casting the ya shadow ki. They are saying what is the height of the tower. So when they are casting, uh, casting uh, same things, we have to height of tower. So how can we the height of tower? Kaise kar, nikal sakte we can compare these two triangles. क्योंकि यहाँ पे हमारे पास दो corresponding angles है, दो triangles के, and if they are similar, then their ratio of sides are similar. तो A part कैसे निकलेगा आपका? You have to take the height of Vijay's house. उसके proportional में क्या लोगे? You can take the shadow, length of shadow of Vijay's house. That would be equivalent to height of tower, main tower. Divided by length of shadow casted by tower. Tower ke respect mein loge. Thik hai? Toh height of Vijay's house hume nikal ni. Nahi hai Vijay house ki. It is given already. 20 meter diya hua hai. Or length of shadow hume kitna diya hua hai? 10 meter. Thik hai? House. Vijay's house is 20 meter in height. And 10 meter is the shadow. Height of tower hume mention. Nahi hai. So height of tower bhi x let's say. Length of shadow kitni hai humare tower ki it is 50. Now cross multiply it to get the value 20 into 50 divided by 10 would give you height of tower. So you would have 5 into 20 which is 100 meter. Thik hai humare paas kya jayega height of tower that's 100 meter. Second situation mein you need to find height of Ajay's house. Ajay's house kaise niklega ab humara. You can compare the tower with Ajay's house now. Tower kitna given hai hume. It is given that this is. Ya in dono ko compare kar lo Vijay aur Ajay's house ko. So that you can get the value for height of Ajay's house. Vijay's house is the height of Vijay's house. Divided by length of shadow of Vijay's house. Is equal to height of Ajay's house. Divided by length of shadow of Ajay's house. ठीक है? अब हमें find out ये करना है. Height of Vijay's house is 20 shadow is then height of Ajay's house आपने निकालनी है ना? That un that's unknown for us. Length of shadow कितनी बन रही थी Ajay की house की? That's 20. Take 20 to the left side. 20 into 20 divided by 10 is equal to height of Ajay's house so 20 into 20 ko ek kaam karte hai but 0 se 0 cancel karte hai so, so that you can get 20 into 2 which is 40 meter so ajay ki house ki height bhi aagi humare paas that's nothing but 40 meter secondly thirdly we need to find what would be the length of the shadow of the tower when vijay's house cast a shadow of 12 meter अब विजय के हाउस की शैडो कितनी हो गई है 12 मीटर की हो गई है एक्चुअल हाइट 20 मीटर थी लेंथ ऑफ शैडो ऑफ टावर पूछ रहे हैं ये हमसे ठीक है तो ऑब्वियसली आप क्या करोगे फिर से यू कैन टेक इट एज सिमिलर तो हमारे पास वैल्यू क्या हो जाएगी यहां पे दिस वुड बी अजेस हाउस की हाइट ऑफ विजेस हाउस इज 20 नो this is 12 meter. So, what will happen here? The situation is like 20 over 12 over 20 over 12 is 20 over 12 equivalent to comparing it with tower. Okay? And what was the length of tower? It was 100. Now, what do we have to do? We need to find the shadow of the tower. What will the shadow of the tower be? So, I need to take the shadow of tower in the denominator because comparison kar rahe hai. So you would get 20. 
take shadow of the tower to the left side shadow of tower equals to 100 into 12 divided by 20 cancel 20 and 100 you would get 5 5 into 12 would be 60 meter